Dimitri Price, oh, wow. That's what I'm saying. He is so hot. He's feeling it, and he's the kind of guy who can go make three in a row, four in a row now. Dimitri, 19 points in two minutes. So did the Gatorade start tasting different? Did somebody say something to you? What happened then? Honestly, yeah, the, the other team was a little bit chirpy, um, especially towards the end of the game. And maybe one of these clips, you'll, you'll probably see me chirping a little bit back. All right, Dimitri, first clip here. You guys are down 12 with two minutes left. Obviously, you've seen your day against the top five team in the country. Right now, what's going through your mind? Um, I just know that we got to get some buckets real fast. Um, obviously, time's winding down, and Illinois is a great team. Um, and I just knew that we needed to make some plays here down the stretch, and I knew that I was going to have the ball in my hands. So, Dimitri, on the trice torch, where are you at right now? Um, after this shot, I was I felt like I was towards heating up. Um, I think it wasn't until my next shot that I started feeling a little bit better. That shot actually didn't even feel that good coming off my hand, so when it went in, um, I was like, oh, okay, so it's one of those type of, type of uh, ordeals. All right, so for this next one, I'll show the made basket, and we'll talk about that for a second. But all people need to know is it results in a three-point game and for you to react like this. Now, you're not a big trash talker from what it seems like. So can you walk me through what, what happened on that play? Well, honestly, throughout the whole game, they, their, their guards were kind of talking and chirping. Um, it was kind of getting on my nerves a little bit. I'm not much of a trash talker, but once I start feeling it and they get under my skin a little bit, um, this is the side that comes out, and I start hitting shots like this. So, um I had a little bit to say after after I made that one because that one I was definitely on your in your radar. I was on Inferno where everything I shot was going to go in, so um, I was feeling good about myself. And actually, I said something as I shot the ball. I was like, "Yep, that's good." And the bench heard me say it too, so they knew I was definitely feeling it. Oh yeah, down to 20 seconds now. Trice over Frazier. He got another one. Did you call that? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and say yes, but I honestly didn't. Um, honestly, when I let go of it, I thought it was like a swoosh. I didn't think I shot it that hard, but obviously when the rim is that big, anything goes in. So to shoot it, and it wasn't even directly at the top of the key, to shoot it and bank it from kind of like the right side, that's that's pretty tough and pretty impressive, actually, now that I look at it. Because that's a, that's a tough shot to, to make. <laughs> I'm definitely in Inferno mode. Um, everything that I shoot is literally going through. So I was feeling really good about myself at this point. How can we take that late game performance against Illinois and just kind of carry it through March Madness? Um, just coming in with the same confidence, um, using that momentum to give us some momentum into the Big Ten tournament and then hopefully into the NCAA tournament win some games here late and end the season on a high note. I think it's it's good to get that momentum going, especially late and heading into March. I think if you keep shooting the ball that well, you guys will probably be cutting down some nets. Definitely. <laughs> I, I appreciate that. Yeah, for sure.